That's why it's like it's fucking. It, bro, I know. It, it. Yeah, it's. Well, the I ring, the ring, the ring's light, but still, the ring's brighter. It's better. It, yeah, but you think that's bright? The ring is like. I'll handle it. I'll just look in the middle of it. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Okay. All right, so. <laughs> What's up, guys? It's your boy Ryan Deviant here, and today I'm bringing you guys a new G Fuel flavor unboxing video. I'm here with my buddy Nick. Hi. Don't say hi to me. Say hi to the camera. I'm, I'm watching the game at the same time. So watching. we're watching uh, CDL Minnesota right now. We're watching the Los Angeles Gorillas, Patty Price uh, take on Prestini and the Florida Mutineers. So if you live under a rock, G Fuel announced, and they've teased the last few weeks a new flavor. And this flavor is French vanilla coffee. Now, Nick and I are coffee connoisseurs, and when it comes to totally derailing my diet, coffee is a go-to because I like caffeine and sugar and all that good stuff when I have a cheat day. So, for my coffee drinkers, now, this, this product is an alternative. It gives you energy. It's made from natural ingredients. 150 milligrams of caffeine, that's about, just about like a normal, normal sized cup of coffee, or if you want a can, I haven't even seen it earlier. A can is 300, that's like a large, oh, don't fall, don't fall. A can, that's like, that's 300, that's like a large cup of coffee. So, we're gonna unbox this, we're gonna try it, it's gonna be a good time, I'm gonna have fun. Still watching, we're, we're gonna keep you guys updated on this game going on right now. It's tied 2-2, they're at map five. Chicago beat Dallas yesterday, and that was really interesting because a lot of people thought Dallas was gonna win, there's been trash talk between both teams, and yeah. And it's about a thousand fucking degrees in here, and the sweatshirt is going to come off. Paper. All right. So as always, with every unboxing video I do, we know we go we go hard here. We get the we get the um, special edition or whatever whatever it is. Listen, I don't know what I'm Collector's edition. So we got this this nice box, nice little ice coffee box that you guys can see. You can see the beautiful white and green shaker in there. We're gonna whip this out and like G Fuel always does, get this. Got a nice sticker. And I forgot to put in like notes to fucking sell it more stickers. So you get the scoop to go, as always if you don't order collector's edition stuff. <laughs> So here is the actual tub. Well, as you guys, that's gonna fall off. Yeah, right. As you guys can see, there is a nice, beautiful graphic. I don't know who the graphic was made by, but good job on the graphic. Um, yeah, like I said before, iced coffee is a go-to on cheap days, and it's our go-to when we go down the shore um, every morning, wherever, whenever we go. Always, I'm taking this fucking switcher over with you, Jesus Christ. Probably right. Okay, so where's the fucking shaker? Where now the shaker's up here. <laughs> so here's the shaker. It's literally like a Starbucks cup. Got the boy. <laughs> so I got Twitter notifications too. Yeah. <laughs> That's okay. So here is the shaker. Um, nice white and green, kind of like a Starbucks cup, I guess. If the guys at G Fuel decide to not drink G Fuel, they get Starbucks. I don't know if that would logically make sense, but it's the same as caffeine. It's caffeine. I, I, I probably I I would imagine so. So I've I'm not sure how we're gonna do this. I don't watch how they make iced coffee at Dunkin' Donuts or wherever I go, but I've seen like three quarters of a cup of water and a quarter cup of milk and some ice. I don't think I have enough ice to get. It's okay. So we're gonna do uh I guess some close-ups or something. We're gonna do some yeah, we're gonna do some close-ups and then we're gonna Pour your shit up, try it, rate it, talk about it, and yeah. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. He's one in six. Look at him. Decimates, How is he? decimates ten and four. How is he second, but he's one in six? I don't know. And Saints is six and five. All right, so right now the Mutineers are up 4-3. Patty P just got a pick. Nice, good for him. Uh, Mutineers are up 4-3. So we, well, I cleaned. 
I cleaned. Come on, there's ice. Okay, well, there's ice in here. So I cleaned this one. Fucking cleaned the one that came in the box. And we're gonna let Nick use the fucking perfect from our boy Pomage. So we're gonna do just like we've been instructed by the community members of GD Fuel. Did you leave the milk downstairs? No, it's right here. So we're gonna do three quarters of a cup of water here. I'll just assume that's two quarters. Very good. That's about you see if it. Was, you see, if you would have filled it up completely, then it'd be a whole cup. Yeah. Okay, so let's was, not do that. It was, it was, it was a good estimate. That's the, I was gonna say that's the one thing oh, that I like, was not looking me. forward to. It's just like I was watching people make it and they were mixing milk with water. Yeah, dude. Anytime if I run out of like water when I make protein shake. You know? If you guys are bulking, if it's bulk season for you, or if you just have a personal preference of having almond milk first water in your protein shakes, just stick with the almond milk, man. Might be like X amount of calories. Might be X amount of calories more, but just stick with almond milk. Gives it a, like the slightest bit of flavor. Right. You can smell the coffee. You can definitely smell the coffee. Oh my god. That's a fat that's a fat brew of coffee right there. Alright, so a whole last coffee. It's just a whole fucking coffee. Here's one of yours. Yeah, it's just you're, you're good. No, no, so that's fine. And the noise you hear is my dogs barking. I have my studio door open because having two lamps on plus my computer and the heat that I'm sure right now is not even like cranking for any given reason because it's like 50 out in Jersey right now because we just got rain after like a fucking week of freezing cold and snow. And snow. And 4 4, huh? Yeah. Shit. S&D wins championships, guys. Don't forget that. You just <laughs> gotta squeeze it. It's a lot. You literally just have to squeeze the scooper. Dump it out. <laughs> no, it's good. It's, it's fine. It's fine. There's enough in there. Here's me. There you go, bud. No, I'll do mine the proper way. That'll be the second. <laughs> Fuck yourself. <laughs> You know you can top the top off here. Your... Pretty sure yeah. Perfect. You know, you know why the funnel's there, though, right? It's for wood. Yeah. Yeah. Or if you want to just get a huge scoop, you can just scoop the entire thing. It doesn't really help. Though. Hold on, let me just get that freshness packed in. There. That's 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 where all the flavor is. And the freshness packed. Let me take 20 minutes to just get a scoop. Do you, you want me to do a cinematic of you putting the scoop in? No. Well, the gorillas are up. 5-4. Decimate is going 12-5 in s and right now. So, we got our three quarters cup of water and our ice in there. I'm pretty sure probably in the near future I'm just going to do on the milk. Yeah, I'm going to say this is more of a... I'm not trying to measure out water and milk every time I try to drink it. I mean, you just got to eye it. I don't use it. I. I That's literally like, made to break up the fucking powder. Oh, right, well, whatever. Because when there's chunks in your shit, yeah, like half of your body's out of the way. Please, hold on. There we go. Alright. Ready? Right. Cheers. Cheers. Okay. That's pretty fucking 
Yeah, that's, that's not a good supplement for coffee. That, that bro, dude, honestly, oh, that no, is not bad. bad. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's not that <laughs> bro, bad. No, that's not good. What, what, what do we go down there? We're, 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 we're just gonna, gonna literally line my uh, kitchen table. There's gonna be like eighteen shaker of it. cups of it. Oh no, this is really good, <laughs> dude. Whoever thought of this, like, give them a raise. That's a good idea. Like, Cliff, up their salary. Like, I don't know whose idea it was, but. Oh, LA just one. No, the, the girl is just one, by the way. But, up, give this man a raise. It's fucking really good. <laughs> it beats having to go to Duncan. So. Yeah, the coffee, Dunk, uh, Dunkin' Coffee's what? Like, a large coffee at Dunkin' Donuts is like four bucks. Three, four bucks. Um, a tub of this is 36 on its own. And you'll. No, is it? No, it's 30. I'm pretty sure. Oh, it's 40. We're full for time. Alright, okay. Alright, so it's 40 servings. So, financially, for those of you who are addicted to Dunkin' Donuts coffee, you spend three, four dollars a day for thirty days. At the end of the day, you're out like ninety to one hundred and twenty dollars, depending on how much you spend. Some people will spend more than that, but you even spend more than that in a day in terms of buying coffee from Dunkin' Donuts because it's just so addicting. But this this flavor is probably the by far the best thing to satisfy any cravings you have for coffee. Even if you're dieting and you really, really want that cheat meal from Dunkin', this is a go-to for. Um, substituting it 100% you could probably add this to your breakfast if you're having like oatmeal or something just to give it flavor because coffee flavored anything is really fucking good come on bro we're doing the product we're trying to fucking sponsor it we want more coffee, we want more coffee. <laughs> I, I think I'm done I, I, I definitely definitely think I'm going to stick with almond milk though um but yeah, I would definitely give this flavor a 10 out of 10. What would you give it? Uh, I kind of like the actually, I like actually being able to taste the French vanilla because I know when you go to Dunkin' that you can barely taste the French vanilla. Uh, but I actually like being able to taste it. Uh, it's not overpowering, like over sweet, like how most coffee would be. And then like, you can either do just water, just milk. You can change how you want to do the water and the milk. Yeah. Overall, it's pretty freaking good. Um, we're watching Ace get interviewed. Probably talking, yep, definitely talking shit. Um, he just got his fake ID. Looks like is. All right, anyway, guys, this flavor smacks. Um, definitely, as someone who is into lifting and eating healthy, um, uh, irony, I was a nutrition major like a month ago. Um, I would definitely recommend this to anybody who has a slight addiction to coffee and getting $3, $4 worth of coffee from Dunkin' Donuts every single morning. You can literally pour this in a shaker, throw some milk in there. You're saving time and money from stopping at Dunkin' Donuts and then waiting in a line if you're going to the drive through on the way to work. Literally just plop a scoop in a shaker or in a cup, you stir it, shake it, whatever, and you're, you chug it, keep it, whatever, you're out the door, you're in your car, you're on your way to work. It'll save time money and most of all your diet if you are dieting and you really want to cheat meal from Dunkin Donuts or just any coffee craving in general. Overall, good job to the boys at G Fuel, flavor smacks like always. Um, this will be uploaded tonight or tomorrow. It's currently, today is Saturday, it's going to probably be uploaded tonight, late or tomorrow. But as always, it's been your boy Ryan Deviate and I will see you guys in the next video. You want to say anything else or is that it? Uh, no. <laughs> All right, guys. Sponsor me. Yeah. All right. Well. All right. See you guys in the next video. Peace.